here. This is like so cool. Put my name in the suggestion box. What? What? Um, <laughs> So, so some of you at this point are like, is it all going to be webcomic songs? I'm actually making up what you're thinking so I can do my shtick. So if you're thinking, is it all going to be webcomic songs because I do not read the webcomics. No, it is not. I'm going to do a song now about something we all have, something we've had for at least probably longer than I've been alive. Um, I'm going to do a song about computers. This song is called Canary. <laughs> bunch of dorks. <laughs> Do you remember the first time you touched a computer? Because even before Atari, there were computers. <laughs> 299 bitches! <laughs> <laughs> I hunted my first wampus when I was two years old and I still remember the song they played for me. You could go and flit some doom until your mom told you to go clean your room. And at school there was that one class called computers. And if you were good at that one class called computers, everyone would watch you as you started to play, because it was time to go blow some buffalo <laughs> away. Yeah, Oregon Trail jokes never get old. I have because <laughs> once you take your family safely across the Oregon Trail, always you take your family safely across the Oregon Trail, except when you let them get dysentery so you can write their path. And you write one that makes everyone laugh. Here lies Butts. He has a butt. <laughs> and then, well, then you went to college. And then what kind of a disappointment was college? still had to show your freaking work and do assignments that had no purpose. But saving the princess had a purpose. Defeating GLaDOS had a purpose. It was continuous improvement of a measurable skill, and for most of us, it was a triumph. And tell me where else do you get to triumph? I mean, unequivocally, inexorably triumph. You rush through your assignments with plus your dexterity and speed so you can get back to what your soul really needs. Alright, so this next reference is a little bit obscure. I will buy a drink for the person who can tell me what game I am referencing, and I'm actually serious. I'm not bullshitting you. Because <laughs> once you save your little brother from ape eating crocodiles, always you save your little brother from ape eating crocodiles. Commander Keen? Donkey Kong Country 2 Diddy's Conquest. Oh, yeah. Thank you. And once you, <laughs> say, once you save the princess, you can't handle her being found, so you pay Bowser to make sure she's not around. <laughs> and by Bowser, I mean Nintendo Corporation. You actually pay your good money to Nintendo Corporation. And speaking of Nintendo Corporation, once you are invincible, you can't handle up being invincible. How old were you when you learned the word invincible? You can't handle up being invincible once you turned on the game genie. You can't unturn on the game genie once you've tasted programming power. There's no going back. Everybody sing do 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 you guys rock so hard. <laughs> and now that we're grown up, well, we're still playing. We joined the grown up world, but we're still playing. No matter what we do, we still come back to the game. And it's not because we think real life is lame. Because it isn't. Real life is awesome. <laughs> you know, they're on a cruise. What? What? 
Does <laughs> <laughs> um, I remember all those books where all those kids went into other worlds to do the things they do. As soon as they got home, they only wanted to come back as there was something there that the rest of the world lacked. You can say it was the challenge or the test, but you and I both know it was the freaking ass quest. Don't make me drop the Campbell bomb. You know what I mean, cause you know we all were once kings and queens. Cause once a king or queen of Canary, always a king or queen. Once a king or queen of Canary, always a king or queen. That's how we took Final Fantasy from numbers 1 to 14. Cause life doesn't let you be a king or queen. I mean, life lets a few people be kings and queens, so we got one on the boat. <laughs> but mostly, I mean, life doesn't let you be a black mage, although that would be ridiculously awesome. Or a dragoon, if you're not into being a dragon. You can be a ninja if you practice really hard, but I'm not sure there's a lot of work for ninjas right now. You could be a thief, that would be easy, but I don't recommend it. Um, you could be a spoony bard. <laughs> Dang it, Final Fantasy, you couldn't think of anything better for me to do. Do, 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 do